Life teaches one thing, that out of the act of love, you have this firework that is called an orgasm. Out of that orgasm, you plant a seed. And that seed takes nine months to grow into a child. We were all child. Everything in life needs maturity. My name is Alexander. I've been performing and recording music under the Merlin Moon name for almost a decade now. Throughout the years, I've been searching for vintage equipment to build this temple and honor the history of music and the legends that inspired us to chase the dream. And since then, I've been in the journey of taking music, emotions, and make, make, make the emotions as tangible as I can perceive them so I can share them. I want to tell you a story about love. Romeo and Juliet. Dead. Historic Sounds is a love story about music and the equipment used to make history. After a decade of traveling and trading gear, a guitar amplifier for a compressor, a couple of compressors for an EQ and, and delay here and find some tape machines in a pawn shop. And I had things in studios in LA and some in my home studio. I left uh, Los Angeles and came to Miami and decided to build the studio that I've dreamed of recording. The benefit of being here is that it's, it feels like you're in some kind of temple. There was something about Abbey Road when the Beatles were there. There was something about Olympic Studios when Led Zeppelin was there. And I guess I invite people to come here to, for them to be in this spiritual kind of like place with the tree of life, completely secluded here, no noise, completely soundproof with everything you need to record an album from Radiohead to Placio Domingo. If you play jazz or you're a you know, hip hop, pop, as long as it's true, it's authentic and it's real, there's people out there who are looking for this. So I invite you to come here and uh, come to the studio. You have the strength to get all the, the fire that comes with it, the negative things and the positive things, and then this could be your home. And together, So this is fun, this is what we do every day. So uh, I hope you enjoy it. Uh, in the next few episodes, uh, I'm gonna show you about effects, compressors, the Helios console, the keyboards, Mellotrons, Wurlitzer. We have a beautiful collection of historic uh, microphones from the 1920s, 30s, 40s, 50s, 60s, 70s, and until today. I wanna walk you through the history of all these amazing pieces, and uh, I'll let you decide which one you like best. Thank you for listening, and I'll see you next time.